Okay, so in this question, okay, we can see we have to solve for y, and this time solve for y if y is between negative 68 degrees and 112 degrees. It's a very odd interval, but it's um, appropriate for this question that we have. And here we can see we are given that we have to solve y, but y is inside a trigonometric ratio. Now, when we have that, we want cos of some sort of formula with our unknown in equal to a constant number. And once we have that, all we do is we take this formula equal to the inverse or arc cos of um, that number. And that's what we have here. Okay, here you can see we already have cos of our function little with the y in equal to a constant number and we're very happy with that. Now, all we need to do now is say, okay, well now that means that our this interior here, that negative 2y plus 44 is going to equal our um, inverse angle, okay? So let's calculate that. That means it's equal to arc cos of negative 0 0.9903. And what do we get? Okay, we get uh, 0.9903, a negative number. If we take the second function of cos, the arc cos of that, we get 172.01. So 172.01, let's round to one decimal place. I'm sure this is 172, okay? So we get that negative 2y plus 44 is equal to 172 degrees, okay? These are all degrees. And now all I need to do is solve y. It's a normal, normal equation. So I get negative 2y is equal to 172 degrees minus 44 degrees, which means this is 172 minus 44 is 128 degrees. So negative 2y is equal to 128. Obviously, I divide with negative 2, divide with negative 2, and what do I get as my answer? Okay, let's see. We get y is equal to negative Two is that's 64. Negative 64 degrees is the angle that y must take. So that if I take negative 64 and I substitute it in here, I will actually get that cos of this thing will equal negative 0.9903. Let's try that. Let's actually just test that. Cos of negative 2 times 60, negative 64 degrees plus 44, okay, if I take degrees, if I take that, I should get negative 0 0.9903, so let's, let's try, so we get a 2 with a negative times 64 with a negative, okay, plus 44 is equal, okay, so inside here we get 172 degrees, cos of 172 get, gives me negative 0 0.99026, okay, if I round it to four decimal places, it's 0, 3, and I'm happy. That y should indeed be negative 64 degrees.